हेलो वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ ओ बायोलॉजी एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सेल्स सो व्हाट इज अ सेल अ सेल इज अ स्ट्रक्चरल एंड फंडामेंटल यूनिट ऑफ लाइफ सो सेल्स आर द स्ट्रक्चरल फंक्शनल एंड बायोलॉजिकल यूनिट्स of all living beings cells are referred to as the building blocks of life and the study of cells is called cell biology so now let's discuss about the discovery of cells robert hooke discovered the cell in the year 1665 He observed a piece of bottle cork under a compound microscope and noticed minuscule structures that remind him of small rooms. Then he named the small rooms as cellulae, later which was named as cells. As his microscope had limited magnification so he could not see any details in the structure and the cells which were discovered by him were non living cells later anton van leeuwenhoek observed cells under another compound microscope with higher magnification this time he had noted that the cells exhibited some form of movement as a result he concluded that these entities were alive and these entities were named as animal cules and in the year 1883 robert brown provided the very first insight into the cell structure he was able to describe the nucleus present in the cells of orchids so let's move to the types of cell so cells are basically of two types one is prokaryotic cell and another is eukaryotic cell in this video i will discuss about prokaryotic cells so prokaryotic cells are single celled microorganisms or unicellular microorganisms known to be the earliest on earth prokaryotes include bacteria and archaea the photosynthetic prokaryotes include cyanobacteria that perform photosynthesis a prokaryotic cell consists of a single membrane so all the reactions occur within the cytoplasm of the cell so now let's discuss about the characteristics of prokaryotic cells First of all prokaryotic cells lack a nuclear membrane mitochondria golgi bodies chloroplast and lysosomes are absent in prokaryotic cells the genetic material of prokaryotes is present on a single chromosome the histone proteins the important constituent of eukaryotic chromosomes are lacking in them the cell wall is made up of carbohydrates and amino acids the plasma membrane of prokaryotes acts as the mitochondrial membrane carrying respiratory enzymes prokaryotes divide asexually by binary fission and the sexual mode of reproduction involves conjugation most of the prokaryotes are the smallest of all organism ranging from 0.5 to 2 micrometer in diameter and the hereditary material can either be dna or rna now let's discuss about the structure of prokaryotic cells the outer protective covering found in the bacterial cells in addition to the cell wall is called capsule it helps in moisture retention and protects the cell when engulfed and helps in the attachment of cells to nutrients and surfaces 
this capsule may also protect against the host immune system the outermost layer of the cell which gives shape to the cell is known as the cell wall the main component of the bacterial cell wall is peptidoglycan and now the cytoplasm cytoplasm simply means everything found inside the plasma membrane it is a gel like structure inside the plasma membrane it is mainly composed of enzymes salts and cell organelles now what is the plasma membrane the layer surrounds the cytoplasm and regulates the entry and exit of substances in the cells is known as the cell membrane or plasma membrane the protein tubes originating from the cytoplasmic membrane of many bacteria are known as pili and fimbri pili are the longer hair like structure originating from the cytoplasmic membrane they are longer than fimbri and fewer in number than fimbri and fimbri are greater in number and shorter than pili in singular we can tell pili as pillars some prokaryotes consist of flagella or in singular flagellum these are the long structures in a form of a whip that help in the locomotion of a cell a prokaryote can have one or several flagella localized to one pole or spread out around the cell and the cell organelles involved in the protein synthesis are known as ribosomes the non chromosomal dna structures present inside a prokaryotic cell are known as plasmid and these plasmids are not involved in reproduction next one is the nucleoid region nucleoid is an irregularly shaped region within the prokaryotic cell that contains all or most of the genetic material of the cell the chromosomes of a prokaryote is circular and its length is very large compared to the cell dimension now let's see the diagram of a prokaryotic cell so a prokaryotic cell looks like this and this is the flagellum of this cell this is the plasmid of the cell and this is the cytoplasm now this is the ribosomes and these are pili and this is the capsule of this cell the smaller hair like structures are the fimbri and this is the cell wall which protects the cell then this is the plasma membrane and finally this is the dna or the nucleoid region which stores all genetic materials of the cell i think that you have understood the structure of prokaryotic cells so i have discussed about what is cell i have discussed about the discovery of cell i have also discussed about the types of cell and i have also discussed about the structure and the characteristics of prokaryotic cells so thank you for watching the video please like the video and share the video and please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon we'll meet you in the next video thank you